What's going on, people? I am Wesley from AK Nation TV, the network, and you are watching me because I decided to come on and record. Why? Because New York is the sixth and the largest state to legalize same sex marriage. Why? Because love is not a crime. Okay? Now, I created this shirt last year when I went to uh, New York Pride and I was in the Pride like, ah! Get it on, get, get it on, cause they play this awesome beat. And for those of you that remember that video, y'all know what I'm talking about, but I, I was living. It was me and Kevin from The Scorpion Show and Lonel from 3LW TV, Maurice Jamal from uh, Glow Network. Uh, it was just, it was an amazing time. Bryant was there, uh, Lasto was there, I think Chaos was there. Um, and Alan Andre was there. There was a lot of us there um, living for the whole prize situation. But this time go around this year, and I, I'm thinking I'm gonna go to the pride tomorrow, but this year is, is more of a phenomenal uh, 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 event for us um, as a people, not just as gays or lesbians or, you know, just us as a people because Love is not a crime. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> and what boggles the mind, I was going to do a poem and, and all of that, but my poem was getting a little heavy and thick. And I was like, all right, don't do the poem. Um, because when I do my poetry, I really go hard and I, I really throw reality into everybody's faces and their ears and allow them to understand the truth. But I'll just say this. It boggles the mind how, as a black man, or as a black woman, I could hate on gays and lesbians. It boggles the mind on how, um, as as a as a white man or woman, um, you know, I, I can hate upon somebody else for what they do. I just don't understand it, especially minorities. I, I do not understand. Okay, uh, because racism is is prevalent and it is it is here. Period. It's not going anywhere. Okay. Um, and you know, I could I could clearly see somebody who goes into a situation and has to deal with racism and, and, and how they oh 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 equal rights equal rights but then when somebody comes in and be like okay with their hand holding their hand uh you know holding their partner's hand whether it's a male and a male or a female and a female everybody's like oh oh oh, oh you know what I'm saying? I I just I, I do not understand it and I, I know I'm kind of rambling because I just don't want to be articulate with this video, but it just, it, it angers me to a certain point when I hear individuals talk about how life should be and how marriage should be, let alone uh, marriage in itself has been so tarnished for years, okay? The traditional concept of marriage has been so tarnished and so, so uh, just misused for years from heterosexuals and you know they're still trying to make it seem like it's some grand thing you know what I'm saying like I just don't get it and nowadays people get married like it's the new it bag you know what I'm saying like the new Prada the new Gucci you wearing a new Louis yeah I just got married yesterday you like it and then they get they get divorced in like a week or so so I mean I just don't understand how people could be so gung-ho about not allowing people people period to get married when they want to or if they're if they feel that they're in love it just doesn't make any sense to me but anyways um it's a joyous occasion it's a joyous weekend gay pride in new york city if you're in new york city come out we always have a good time no drama okay all love for all people all colors all ways of life as long as you're not hurting anybody and doing physically bodily harm to anybody you should be able to live your life with freedoms that comes with being alive and being able to breathe, okay? We all live under one sun, okay? We all breathe the same air, okay? So, I mean, and I'll just leave it at that. I'm Wesley from A Connection TV, the network, here on YouTube where we adopt similar connections despite our differences. Doesn't matter who I love, doesn't matter who you love, just we all need to adopt these connections despite our differences and just live. Uh, Okay, just live, people. And one more thing before I go, I just had to do this. If you're out there and you're, you're, you're feeling challenged about who you are, because that is who you are, it's not something that you've 
placed on your shoulder and said, I'm going to be what the world despises and what the world hates. And, you know, I'm going to be a part of this. And the world tells me that I should go to hell. Nobody would freely choose that. Okay. Um, you are who you are. Love who you are. Be who you want to be. As long as you're not physically doing any harm or causing any havoc in the world, in the public, you are fine. There's nothing wrong with you. You do not have to be DL. You do not have to shadow yourself. You do not have to cage yourself because no life is worth worth that if you have to not be you, if you can't be you. You know what I'm saying? And and, and, and no matter where you are, and I I and I you know I I know I'm 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 saying some things because I'm in the place that I'm in. I totally get that. And a lot of young individuals are struggling right now to be who they want to be and and I, I I totally know what you're going through um, I've been there but to the to the young kids that are living at home with their parents who are hypocrites who are ignorant who are closed-minded who are who who are the devils themselves okay because they don't know what true life is the ability to live is okay I understand your situation I'm not telling you to walk in your house and be like, hey, ma, what's going on? I'm not telling you to do that, okay? What I'm telling you to do is because I, I had to do this too, and I, I, this video is important. I wanted it to be short, but it is an important message. I had to do this too. I had to, I had to leave a little bit of that inside, like the, you know, Ow. You know, it's it's in all of us. It's it's in the straightest man. It's in the 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 butchers of the of the queens. Okay, it's it's in all of us. That ow, getting the nails done and all that. It's there's a little bit of that in all of us. Okay, but when I was young, girl, I had to subdue that a little bit. Still be myself. Okay, because myself was regular. West, you know what I'm saying? But I had to subdue that because I knew where I, where my environment was. Am I telling you that's right? No. Certain things work out for certain people. Um, but it worked out for me because I didn't feel like I was letting myself down in any way. And then once I was able to move out of my mother's place, move, move away from that and live my own life, I was in my own apartment when I was 17. I've mentioned this before in other videos. I was like, fuck the world. Fuck the world in their point of view of me. You know what I'm saying? Once once you're not in somebody else's space and you're not in somebody else's life and you control yours, you can do whatever the hell you want to do and feel good for doing whatever the hell you want to do. You know, for these young kids that are at homes, at these homes with these ignorant parents and these ignorant siblings, you know, I'm, I, I can understand how difficult it can be for you. Okay, but like I said, I moved out on my own when I was 17. You have the ability to do that, okay? If you want to, okay? Um, but I just had to say that. I love all people and uh, all people with pure hearts and good souls, okay? And the ability to love no matter what. Love is not a crime, people. It really isn't. And if you want to get this shirt, to rock this shirt, to feel that, to be that, the link is below, okay? I just... I, I just had to do this because I, I want to go to Pride tomorrow, but I got to work tonight and <laughs> I work on overnights. And so to, to get up and be at the Pride, I mean, I did it last year, but it's like last year was just, I don't know. It was just a crazier situation because I was actually in the parade. So it was hot. But anyways, I'm happy and it's a beautiful thing. And, and I, I love the fact that we're able to be able to get one step closer to true freedom. Okay, and that's freedom of choice, freedom of will, and freedom of love. I'm Wesley from A Connection TV, the network. Like I said, people, love yourself, be yourself. Don't care what anybody else thinks, okay? You know, I'm one person that never, 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 never came out and told anybody that I am gay. Never. Never. Because it's nobody's motherfucking business, how? It's nobody's business, girl. Yeah. So, um, you know what I would like to tell y'all. No, just play. But <laughs> anyways, you don't have to tell anybody that you're gay. Because nobody comes up to you and tells, them, tells you that they're straight. So, you don't have to do that. You don't have to. You do not have to do that. Okay? You're, you're, this is not how it should be. Hey, what's going on? I'm Wesley. And I'm gay. No. Hey, what's going on? I'm Wesley. How are you? You know what I'm saying? Like, that's it. Love life, be you, and understand that you're, 
you're human, and no matter what it is that you love, who it is that you love, okay, um, I love you, okay, and uh, the truth above loves you. Later.